Hi, and welcome to Home Alchemy. Today we will be making copper two benzoate using the chemicals we made in our previous videos. For this experiment, you will need copper two carbonate, which we made in our first video. You will also need benzoic acid, which we purified in our last video. First, weigh out 50 grams of benzoic acid. This is around 50 grams of benzoic acid. Dissolve the benzoic acid into about 400 milliliters of distilled water. Benzoic acid is almost insoluble in water at room temperature, but soluble in hot water. I'm going to be pouring this benzoic acid into the distilled water. Now I'll be mixing it. Um, well, as you can see, um, dissolving the benzoic acid will take, uh, quite a while. Wow, it looks like snow. Gosh, why does this thing smell so bad? Okay, here we are. All the benzoic acid is now dissolved. Next, add 25, <coughs> 29 grams of copper 2 carbonate. Okay, we're going to start adding it. And it's going to fizz and foam, producing carbon dioxide gas. Okay, it's starting to fizz. Kind of like Coke. Wow, look at that beautiful blue color. It's like the ocean. Here we are. All the copper carbonate has reacted with the benzoic acid to produce copper two benzoate. It's a beautiful turquoise color. Now set up for vacuum filtration. To do a vacuum filtration, you will need a vacuum flask. Here it is. We will now attach the vacuum flask to the clamp. You will also need a Buchner funnel. Here is a Buchner funnel. It has a lot of little holes. Attach the Buchner funnel to the vacuum flask. Next, you will need a vacuum pump. Here is a vacuum pump. Attach the hose from the vacuum pump to the side arm of the vacuum flask. Now add the filter paper to the Bickner funnel and skirt some water on it for it can be wet with water, distilled water. Turn on the vacuum pump. Now add the copper benzoate to the copper, to the filter. hot water and pour it into the nuclear funnel. Hot water will get rid of the benzoic acid. Heat the vacuum pump on until all the copper benzoate has dried. Here's some hot water. We're going to add it to the copper benzoate just in case if there's any more acid.
copper benzoate is now dry. Remove it from the vacuum filter. And place it into a large dish. Here's our final product of copper 2 benzoate. It's a beautiful turquoise fluffy powder. Place it in a warm, dry place for several days. Please subscribe, like, and comment.